Hello and welcome to the 11 o'clock news from Bahrain International. I'm Shadi Aqil. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa sent a cable of condolences to the Cuban President Raul Castro on the death of leader Fidel Castro. His Majesty expressed his sympathy to the President and the people of Cuba, recognizing the role of the deceased in developing Cuba and its renaissance, as well as his stance and support for Arab issues, as well as defending rights in various parts of the world. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa sent a cable of condolences to the President of the Cuban Republic Raul Castro on the death of leader Fidel Castro. In the cable, His Royal Highness the Premier expressed his sympathy to the President and the people of Cuba, pointing out the role of the deceased in developing Cuba and its renaissance, as well as his stances and support for Arab issues, as well as defending rights in various parts of the world. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa sent a cable of condolences to the President of the Cuban Republic, Raul Castro, on the death of leader Fidel Castro. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince made reference to the role of the deceased in developing Cuba and its renaissance in his stances and support for Arab issues as well as defending rights in various parts of the world. The representative of His Majesty the King, King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, the Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports and President of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, an honorary Chairman of the Bahrain Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, crowned the winners of the season opening race for the 120 km distance and the international and local qualifying races for the 80 km and 40 km distance, which is the first race for the season of 2016 to 2017. His Highness congratulated the winners and affirmed that the performance levels demonstrated by the riders indicates the intensive preparations for the sport in Bahrain, which is cared for by His Majesty the King, and noted that the race was an exciting and a competitive one among the riders, which made significant efforts despite the rainfall, as they were keen to finish the race in addition to their concern for the safety of the horses. He also highlighted that indications from earlier races predict a very competitive season, which will be a positive outcome for the riders to take part in international events, pointing to the importance of preparing outstanding riders. The President of the Bahrain Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, brief His Highness Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa, expressed pleasure in the performance levels of the participants in the race, emphasizing the importance of hard work and dedication in order to elevate the sports of endurance horse riding to exceptional levels.
the Vice President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, Honorary President of the Bahrain Mixed Martial Arts Association, Founder of the Khalid bin Hamad Mixed Martial Arts Organization, KHK MMA, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, invited the President of the International Mixed Martial Arts Federation, IMMAF, Kareth Brown, and IMMAF CEO, Denzin White, to attend the second edition of Brave Combat Federation Championships scheduled at the Khalifa Sports City Hall on December 2nd. His Highness said that he looks forward for the presence of Mr. Kareth Brown and Mr. Denzin White, CEO of the IMMAF in Bahrain, to attend the second Brave Combat Federation Championships. His Highness also said that it is his goal to strengthen ties with the IMMAF to enhance the sport and give the Federation a chance to get to know Bahraini talent that is constantly showcased at a global level. His Highness added that the Brave Championship is still young, but gained prominence on the international level thanks to the plan put in place to attract big-name professional fighters. The festival shows are the first Deputy President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports. President of the Bahrain Athletics Association, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, Theater Award for National Clubs, Youth Center, and People with Disabilities continued yesterday with the 11th show titled Seven Days Comedy by Ashahura Youth Center. The award is organized by the Ministry of Sports and Youth Affairs in collaboration with the media office of His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa at the Isa Town Cultural and Sports Club Hall with the slogan Painting a Smile. The festival is sponsored by Tamkeen. Batelco, Benagas, Coca-Cola, Al Hawaj, G Pick, Majestic Cars, the Economic Development Board, Bob Co, Palace Enterprises, Gulf University, Nissan, Yusuf bin Ahmed Kanu, and Gadua. <laughs>